Selena Gomez has shared a snap of her chin acne to her 423 million followers on Instagram. She posted the pic with the caption, even my skin is over me right now, revealing a blemish and pimple on her chin. The actress and makeup mogul has long been sporting the makeup-free aesthetic, posting numerous pictures and videos to her social showing her natural beauty. This isn't the first time she's given her followers a glimpse into her struggles with acne. As in February 2023, the star shared this snap with a blemish under her nose, captioning it, me. Fans were quick to leave Selena uplifting comments, with one writing, the best photo ever, unbelievably beautiful without any makeup, love you, and another saying, love that natural look. Selena may enjoy going makeup free, but has spoken about how important skincare is to her. Speaking to Vogue in 2020, she said, when you're taking care of your skin, you're taking care of your body, and your mind, and soul. I think it's all connected. She went on to address her bouts of acne, saying, I try not to pick at anything, something that's hard. But how does the star achieve that fresh and glowy look? Well, she also revealed in the interview that she swears by sunscreen, saying, I like to put sunscreen on, not only because it's important to keeping your skin looking fresh, but I have lupus, so being in the sun is kind of difficult for me. Obviously, Selena isn't always fresh-faced, with the star having her own makeup brand, Rare Beauty. She certainly enjoys a dazzling makeup look from time to time. On her press tour for her new film, Amelia Perez, Selena has showcased many stunning makeup looks and recently took to the red carpet to showcase a gorgeous smoky eye and nude lip combo. This isn't the first time that Selena has got everyone talking about her beauty secret secrets though. Selena Gomez has revealed exactly what cosmetic work she has done in response to a video circulating the internet. But when it comes to Selena, I literally have no idea what to attribute her physical changes too. I literally have no idea what she has gotten done. In the resurfaced video, Marissa, a plastic surgery physician assistant, outlines, I think she has been through so much in her life especially medically related, so I don't think it's fair to speculate whether or not she's gotten cosmetic things done. Despite this, people were quick to speculate in the comments section. Amongst the speculation was a comment from Selena herself, outlining, Honestly, I hate this. I was on stripes because of flare-up. I have Botox. That's it. Leave me alone. Marissa has responded to Selena's comment, stating, I really hope Selena Gomez does not hate me. You don't owe it to anyone to, like, tell us why you don't look the same as what you did when you were a teenager or like in your 20s. To which Selena confirmed, I love you, not about you. I just get sad sometimes. This isn't the first time an A-lister has taken to the comments to set the record straight. Hailey Bieber has responded to a video on TikTok in which a London-based aesthetics doctor claimed that Hailey developed a skin condition due to the overuse of specific products. She's been using way too many actives ingredients and as a result has developed perioral dermatitis. The Road founder, who has previously been open about her experiences with the condition. So I wanted to talk about perioral dermatitis because this is something that I have had since I was about 19 or 20. Commented under the video, I've had POD since I was 19, so I'd say after eight years, I know a lot of what works for me and what doesn't. I've been very vocal about minimal product use and being very sensitive to actives. Periodontal dermatitis is an inflammatory skin eruption that typically appears as a red rash around the eyes, nostrils, and the mouth. But what are actives? Active ingredients are the specific elements added to skincare products to target specific concerns. Essentially, an active ingredient is a molecule or chemical that is supposed to be doing what the product says it should do. For example, hydrate skin or treat acne. Some research shows that overusing skincare in general can lead to itchy, red, or flaky skin, or in some cases, lead to more severe skin damage. When it comes to actives, multiple skincare professionals or brands recommend you avoid overusing or combining them as it can damage your natural skin barrier. Some research indicates that certain ingredients can also be a trigger for perioral dermatitis for some, but of course, this depends from person to person.